While her career at Roanoke was brief, Crystal Wilson Hirsch forged a legacy that will last forever as a Maroon. In her two years in Maroon and White, Crystal was an unstoppable basketball force. Athletically, she brought that leadership and that attitude out on the floor uh, to go along with her skill. Her skill level was unmatched. She had a, a great shot 15 feet in, such a smooth, easy shot that whenever she had the ball in her hands, it was going to go in. Um, she had a, a refused to lose attitude. Uh, she worked hard, uh, ran the floor well, um, and again, she was just she was just so uplifting. Wilson collected 453 rebounds, which at the time of her graduation was ninth on the all-time list. In her first season as a Maroon, she was selected second team All ODAC, and in her final season, Crystal was a first team All Conference choice and earn all American accolades. It was funny because our numbers, I was 35, she was 34, so people, you know, when we go in games, you know, I feel like, no, seriously, you don't want to guard me, you want to guard her, she's the better one, she's the good one, <laughs> which they soon found out, you know, that didn't take too long to figure out. Crystal had a way of creating things that weren't there. She was dynamite on offense and defense. She was aggressive, she was tenacious, she went after every loose ball on the floor. She created things when we thought there was no way possible. She got in there, she did all the dirty work, she did all the rebounding, scrapping for the ball. She led our team in scoring. She was, she was a force to be reckoned with. Wilson ranks third in all-time scoring average for Roanoke women's basketball at 15.6 points a game. She was also selected Rono College Female Athlete of the Year in 1995. In addition, she was a first-team All-ODAC Volleyball selection that senior year, leading the team in kills and blocks. But stats are only part of the story for the Rono College heroic athlete. Wilson left the college in the Midwest to join the Maroon family. She was also looking for her real family. Crystal was reunited with her father in a story of perseverance, courage, and character. I will tell anybody that it was just amazing to me to see a young woman her age willing to give up everything that she had to make this trek to, to try to find her father. Um, she realized, I think, that um, she'd wasted a lot of time up to that point not knowing him or his family. And she wanted to know him and she wanted to find out more about him. And the people that he that he lived with and that side of the family and um, and she she decided on her own that she was going to do this and she uh, she took a chance she wasn't afraid to take a chance which told you something else about her um, and it's just it was amazing a girl her age and you know I was just every day I just couldn't believe it I just think it's like one of those fairy tale endings in the fact that she gained a family with her father and she gained a family with us and it we were all a part of it she became a part of our family and it was great to be able to share in something like that because when you have your own family and you're close to see somebody be able to reunite with theirs I think it really just says a lot about a person to persevere in a situation like that and if you see my reflection in snow covers his where the land's like bring it down And if you see my reflection in the snow-covered hills Well, the land's like bring it down Crystal Wilson Hirsch now has three families, her close family, her Roanoke College women's basketball family, and now the Roanoke Athletic Hall of Fame family. Crystal, welcome home to one of our favorite daughters. There goes my life.